What the fuck is up? It is the motherfucking magical Robin Hood fiend. Yo, what do y'all expect? I'm fucking printing money, bruh. First play, the, the big S, SPXS play. I made a little side play with two debit spreads. I cashed them out today. They were I put I put in two debit spreads for 44 bucks. I cashed out two debit spreads for 50 bucks. Six dollars, a little 13% return. Small on, on a small amount of money, big time return. And guess what? Palantir gave me a warning for feeding too much and doing day trades. What? Don't they know who I am? I'm the Robin Hood feed. Yo, they need to relax. But for real, I, I I was doing a little challenge with myself. I turned. I got 10 bucks. I got a little. Uh, I bought a put Friday morning, sold it for like fr uh, Friday afternoon, $10 to $34, took those $34, turned them to $43, and with those $43, I bought a put today, and let's see what that $42 gets us, but so far, that's gotten us with $10, we've made $33, that's a 330% return, who the fuck does those, oh yeah, the Robin Hood Fiend, a little horsepower, y'all want to hear a little horsepower, let's go, Oh, yeah, but next play, Jumia, I did the same thing like as Palantir, I started with 65 bucks, turned that tur turned that 65 to 75, and that 75 to 99 fucking bucks, $24 out of, from 60, what is it, 24 bucks from 65, that's a, that's a 37% return, so, so far I've given you 13% return, 330% return, and this 37% uh, return, yo, this fiend's going wild! Yo, I'm hey, yep. telling y'all, I got these plays. Y'all don't believe me, bro. How many fucking more videos do I need to do, bro? Because I'm feeding out, and you guys are missing out. Next play, the bulls, I've been adding shares. I told you, I've been chewing a little bit. I got 70 shares so far at an average price of 414. Uh, I think I'm down like, what, 15 bucks, which is nothing. Not, yeah, nothing, because I'm used to losing thousands of dollars. So 15 bucks, I'm gonna keep adding to my position and I'm gonna stop lighting. people are gonna watch me. So I was spoiled, yes, again. But anywho, yeah, I got the Bulls, 70 shares, $4.14 uh, $4 average price, which I think is pretty good. Because that stock was like, it started at 30 bucks. It's a relatively new one. So if I get anything near that, I'm cooking, bro. That's long term. Next play, the Labu, the Labu calls I told y'all. The Labu calls I told y'all about weeks ago like a week ago but i told y'all about it bro labu's up it was up like 25 percent today so my puts aren't i'm not at break even yet but they're recovering and if we keep having any more days like these bro i'm gonna be breaking even selling them shorting them making money bro i'm telling y'all i'm feeding out i'm having great returns uh amazing friday amazing friday long weekend no trading on monday but it's whatever whatever but yeah so robin hood fiend and the plays just keep getting better i forgot to tell y'all i'm adding more pound church to my portfolio i added 45 shares at an average price of what is it uh, I, I i i didn't put it in the notes uh, you know what i'm a fiend so i'm gonna get them off the top of my head i got 45 shares at a price of around 763 pretty good and then i'm gonna put the picture up so i'm gonna yeah, put Check me in the comments if I got it right. 45 shares at 7.63, and today this uh, Palantir stock went up to $8.20 perhaps. So I was thinking about selling them, but I think that's just a trap. Like, you know, get quick profit, because long term they're gonna rip ass. And you don't go 10, 15 bucks. So I'm, I'm gonna hold them long term. I'm not in a rush to sell them or anything. But yeah, I'm fiending out, making plays out of place. And let's see where these, let's see. Oh shit, there's a car stopping. Anywho, yeah, I'm fiending out. See y'all later.